the Zyber Neck Power Bank for VR gaming, and is exactly what you think it is. You wear it around your neck. It's contoured for that purpose. Um, a soft silicone band, which is flexible. That's the power button, and those lights will illuminate when I turn it on to indicate how much charge is in those batteries. Let me just uh, turn it on for you. Uh, I think you can see it just about. The bright lights for, in my studio here are difficult to see those lights, but they are lit. If I turn it off, it'll be clearer. And uh, those are out now. So that's the socket for plugging into your headset and you do get a cable, that one there, so you run that to your headset. We also get this extra cable here for actually charging the batteries and that plugs into that socket right there. There's two batteries built into this neck band, one here and one here. Now this one's fixed, but this one is removable, so let me show you. Just that catch and it just clips out like that. The idea of this is if you get yourself a spare battery, you can then rotate them. So when one is used up, you get that on charge, you take your fully charged battery from the side, you install it back on the neck band, and then you can continue your gaming session. Um, also note, there is a USB type C socket there, so you can charge it independently from the neck band. Coming up next are the results of my testing. Okay, I'm back after a few days testing and the results are in and it's good for two hours and 20 minutes or roundabouts of extra game time on top of whatever battery charge you have on the Quest 3 already. Now mileage is gonna vary depending on how hard you're running your headset. So if you're watching movies, uh, maybe even streaming PC VR games to the headset, then that's obviously not gonna be working the headset as hard as if you're playing games natively on the headset itself. Um, so yeah, all looking pretty good. Um, it's very comfortable to wear. It sits on your neck. You can see it's shaped for that purpose. Uh, yeah, soft material. Um, yeah, it's very good. It stays in place. No problems really to speak of. Um, even playing sort of like, you know, games where you're moving around uh, fairly uh, uh, frantically in VR, um, it stays in place. It's well balanced. All the weight is on there and it's just shaped to kind of stay in place. So yeah, it doesn't, it's not going to jump off your neck or anything like that. Um, it's a well-designed uh, battery pack. And you might prefer having the weight around your neck rather than added to the headset itself. Um, you obviously can get head straps with built-in batteries these days, or you can retrofit batteries to some head straps. Um, and it certainly works just fine. So yeah, happy to recommend it if you're interested in this. There is a link in the description, so if you want it, check out that. Um, and there you go, guys. That's it for this one. Thank you very much for watching, and I hope you found this one useful. And until next time, bye-bye.